Thank you. Hey everybody, we thought we'd cool you off this weekend. We are under a heat wave warning here in California. Um, as you can see out here by the beach, the heat has been meeting the cold weather, so we're actually getting fog. Some would say it's June blue, but no, it's we're under a heat wave warning. Oh, and when the wind is not blowing, it is hot right here. It's hot. It's supposed to be June blue. Oh, hello. Hmm. Bicycle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway, it's supposed to be 100 degrees in Santa Monica, which is just a few miles, which is really, those are really hot temperatures, record temperatures. Anyway, we're here with Old Camp for uh, MBN News Video Web with comments on the headlines of today, and it's all over for the Republicans. Well, yeah, the president says the, that he's not going to accept anything less than having his immigration reform done before August. He wants it done the month of July and basically there's only four more weeks of their legislative season after they come back from recess and it's not there it's not going to be done no matter what he wants to do because Boynard has been already told if he gives them uh, if he if he approves uh, their so-called amnesty before they do the uh, securing the border, they're going to throw him out of office in November. I mean, they really mean they will throw him out of office in November, and that's got him shook up because he was just going to deliver 38 Republicans to the Democrats and they pass it. But now, since he figures that that would be the last thing he would ever do. And he actually wants to maintain leadership. He he's not going to do it now. He said there either has to be a majority of Republicans, or there'll be no vote on it even held. And that's there'll never be a vote held because they go home for the hot, for a week, and you can guess what they're going to be saying to them when they get back to their constituency. Mm -hmm. And no jury set sequestration or theater shooting trial jury judge rules. Well, yeah, because I love this. Well, because they already know he did it, and he's confessed. Here's the whole trick so is... why are they going through all uh, that? Because they're Democrats, and Democrats have to have jury trials for I mean, show. I mean, if he already admitted it, they have evidence. Yeah, that. but the problem is he's pled guilty by a reason of insanity, and the Democrats basically want the judge to rule that you uh, rule against an insanity defense, which wow. means that he will go free because um, everyone really knows the guy is a fruitcake, folks. Well. <laughs> yeah, and they know it. Uh, well, he basically he was dressed as the Joker when they picked him up, and he was waiting for Batman to come. That would be horrible if he got off on that. Well, no, they'll get him off on it. That's a real gimme that they will get him off because the state of Colorado does not allow an insanity defense. Uh, and when they know that the person is insane, so. Oh, they don't? Yeah. Oh, and Susan Rice, Snowden leaks haven't weakened Obama. Only problem is, is that his poll ratings are, he's, he's, he's aiming, they said aiming for, as George Bush is now in the positive area, he's going below George Bush, said virtually, he, he had the biggest collapse of any second term president ever. Totally. I mean, and it's just because no one trusts. I mean, it was it almost 70% of the Democrats do not trust him now. And new shuttle Atlantis exhibit gives close-up look at space flight. Well, I wonder, okay, see, to us it sounds sort of weird since we have the same thing over here and we basically did an awful lot of, of um, coverage of the, of the other shuttle being brought, was it the Endeavor being yeah. brought in? And so it's old news to us, but I guess it's not old news to the people where they put the Atlantis. It's pretty cool, though. Yeah, we get to see. We, were, we got The thing went right by us I mean, it went times. over our head. We, yeah, really, literally went over our head. <laughs> the wing was almost a little bit too much, folks. Mm -hmm. And Europe tests reusable spaceship. Yeah, that's because it saves them a lot of money if they go to, okay, what it is is Muslims don't believe in space flight, so Obama doesn't believe it, but everybody else in the world but the Muslims has got a space program now. His is just an outreach for Muslims now and for global warming. Obama to put fast food restaurants out of business with calorie taxes. Oh yeah, they're going to, if you're, they're going, you're going to have, if you serve good food, you can stay in business. If you serve what he doesn't approve of, they'll tax you so much on it. They're going to tax you for each calorie over what, what they approve of. Oh gosh, well just ask Paula Dean. Yeah, well, because they you know she's being punished because she's not only white, but because she serves southern food which oh is way too calorie ridden so Ooh. and NASA wants backyard astronomers to help track asteroids 
gown, which anybody ever seen the movie with Elijah Wood? You know, <laughs> when and, okay, the one where the meteor hits the Earth and the asteroid hits the Earth, where uh, that's what that's all about. He was a backyard astronomer that discovered something. It, but what it means is, the, remember, he doesn't believe in us. It doesn't believe in uh, NASA, so therefore NASA is basically being folded rapidly. I know, that is the very sad state of things. Well, but as soon as he goes and they no longer have a Muslim president, which basically people still haven't got it through their head, he does not have to step down. There's nothing in the Constitution that can order it to happen, so. And damage union statue repaired in time for start of Gettysburg anniversary events. I know, and that's something that some moron destroy. Well, because it's a, it's an anti um, anti southern thing again. So they destroyed the southern stuff. That, you know, because they, the soldiers did die there for what they believed in. And Assange. Snowden is healthy and safe and has applied for asylum in Ecuador and Iceland. Yeah, Iceland probably. Is that for Snowden or for Yeah, Assange? for Snowden. Well, because they'll give him in Ecuador because Ecuador yesterday cut off all money being supplied to it from the Obama administration. So that's the sense that... Oh, guess what he's all Yeah. <laughs> the trick is the only way... Okay, here's another thing. Um, uh, Russia has diplomatic flights between... Ecuador and the Soviet Union, which means he can legally leave the country on, an, on a diplomatic flight. Wow. He can't get out of the country any other way because of the fact that uh, our president and his grand wisdom took his passport away. And we do, I have a family, uh, so it wants to be a family, she wants to marry into the family, that can't leave England because the president basically took her passport away because she was born with the wrong name. Oh it doesn't make any difference. Maybe, maybe she should get married and she'll have a different name. It doesn't make any difference. She can't get a passport. This, if they're looking for someone five foot tall in her 70s and about 160 pounds. She's six foot two, redheaded, under 30, and probably nowhere near 160 pounds. She looks like a model. And plus, she's also got a doctor's degree and in, in, in she's a pediatric surgeon, which they need, and she can't do anything because of the, the stupid watch list. But she's also Jewish, which explains it, though. And plaintiffs in gay marriage case wed in California. The problem is the, what the Supreme Court did, which the Supreme Court punted again. They punted on the last issue, too. They're refusing to hear plaintiff's cases on gay marriage, and they have to. The Constitution does not allow you to say, well, we're only going to take cases if the if a state government decides to support or unsupport them. Mm -hmm. So what happens is the state government decides to do neither, which means you never can move it to the... If they think it's one that they want, they'll do it. If they don't want it done, they basically control the court system. Then by choosing not to... Uh, to basically... If, if they decide not to defend something, you, uh, you can't get it in the court. That's, that, that's not where the Constitution works, folks. They're going to have to take the cases because the Constitution says a case that is basically that people have a right to go to the Supreme Court all the time. It was a, per, it was a plaintiff's case that went to the Supreme Court on the Voting Rights Amendment. It was a plaintiff's case that went to the Supreme Court on the Equal Rights thing. An individual did it, which means they say individuals that are harmed have no right to go unless the Supreme Court feels they do now, which is not the way the Constitution works. So, And BlackBerry turned around on inside his shares tumble. Oh, yeah, they figure uh, the company is toasted now because, I mean, God, I mean, I, we knew a month ago, actually more than a month ago, that BlackBerry was dead, but, I mean, the... Um, but nobody would listen. They were dumping their cell phones off. Then well, we knew after the launch party. After the launch party, it died after the launch party, which was horrible. And Chamber of Commerce launched a seven-figure ad buy in support of immigration efforts. No one can understand what they're doing because, the, um, the, okay, the, uh, they, they said that it's going to depress salaries, which they probably like, but it's also going to, which means they're not going to have the buying power and they're going to put people out of work because uh, I heard one person saying, he said, well, we're going to have people to do the jobs that no one else wants to do. And the guy said, yeah, like the black kids used to do the McDonald's. You know, how many Afro-Americans do you see in McDonald's anymore that aren't in management positions? Um. And Graham on Snowden, the Freedom Trail is not exactly China, Russia, Cuba, Venezuela. 
No, but that's probably where he, he, he can go to Venezuela too from the Soviet Union or he can go to Cuba. It doesn't make any difference. Like his father now is trying to work out an arrangement where they won't try him and he'll come back to the United States. Like that's never going to happen, folks. <laughs> And Nelson Mandela's health is showing great improvements, his ex-wife. No, it's, it's, it's not because he's, 90, he's older than I am and in bad health and has been in a long time, so. And a Monty bubble is from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Oh, I like this. Often the answer is right in front of you if you take the time to look.